hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i want to cook in salad soup like white soup with a goat meat so as you can see i have all the ingredients on the table as you can see right now the ingredients is what you're seeing right now so i have my crayfish my vegetable my scotch bonnet pepper i dry fish the goat's meat then the salt onion seasoning cubes and the other things so right now the meat is on the fire i just finished watching it and uh, i'm cutting some onion inside the goat's meat so that i'll parboil it before cooking so guys please if you're returning subscriber make sure you watch the video please comment the comment section tell me what you think about the video please make sure you subscribe to my channel okay make sure you subscribe like my videos and help me also share the video all right so make sure you enjoy my video so after cutting the onions right now i'll add some salt seasoning cubes and then parboil it for the cooking so right now i'm adding the seasoning cubes to the meat no seasoning cubes so after that i'll add some salt to taste i'll add some salt to taste So now, now it has started, you know, boiling. So I'm adding my yam for thickener. I want to use it to thicken the soup. As you can see, I just added it. So I'll cover it to boil. I will cover it. I added some little water to it because the meat is still strong, it has not softened. So now I'm taking out the the yam out from the pot to pound it. I'll take all of them out from the pot so I'll pound it. I'll pound it so that I'll use it for the soup thickener. So make sure you subscribe to my channel, please. Make sure you subscribe. Also share my videos to your family and friends. Like my video, please comment. Write your comments in the comment section down below make sure you subscribe that red button please that red button after watching the video that red button by by the side you just click it just click the red button then you've already subscribed please i'm looking for subscribers please and some people after watching the video they they usually forgot to to subscribe please make sure before you want start watching the video please make sure you subscribe okay just help your girl promote me all right okay right now we are adding the crayfish and the pepper to the soup we're adding the crayfish and the pepper to the soup as you can see that's a boiling the meat has softened already so i'm adding the 
rest of the ingredients to the soup so I'm stirring so make sure you stir it very well this is white soup make sure you stir it very well so right now I'm adding my dry fish I want to dry I want to add the dry fish to the soup I'm adding it right now as you can see the I washed I have already finished washing it so I'm adding it to the soup so after adding it what I'll do after adding it I'll stir it very well make sure you stir it round and round very well so you cover it you know to parboil to simmer you just cover it to simmer for a while so that the the ingredients the salt and the no cubes will marinate with the fish so that everything will marinate to the fish before you now start cooking adding other things so right now I want to cover the pots I'll have to cover the pots right now so I'm adding little salt I'm still adding salt to taste the one I added is a uh, it's not enough so I, I have to add some more to the soup so after stirring now I have to cover it to marinate so make sure you subscribe to my channel make sure you subscribe to my channel help your girl promote your girl subscribe click that subscribe button it's red once you click it you subscribe to my channel it will turn to gray so now i've added my vegetable otazi to the soup and to make it a little bit bitter that's how the sala soup used to be the white soup so used to use this vegetable called otazi for the soup so that it will taste very good when you're eating it so as you can see my soup is almost ready my soup is almost ready so now i want to add the thickener you remember the yam that i i i pounded the yam that i boiled the other time that is the thickener that i'm adding right now so to thicken the soup so i'm adding it right now so after adding it i use my spoon to lay down the the yam that i pound the thickener so that the soup will cover it a bit so after doing that i'll cover it to continue boiling i'll cover it to simmer so right now the soup has taken already as you can see it has taken already as you can see it's thick i think is um, ready to it's ready for eat so we are ready now to eat so right now i have to take out some thickener from the soup so that the the soup will not be thick i don't want it to take in too much so i have to take some parts out from the soup and leave the some pieces inside there so it will not be watery again i have to i'm taking out some some of the thickener from the soup as you can see the soup is ready the soup is ready to eat so make sure you subscribe to my channel as you can see the soup is ready so some i'll leave some thickness too a little bit inside there 
so I have to stare. Make sure you stare it very well. Keep on staring. Even the ones at the bottom. Keep on staring so that everything will come up. Everything will, will marinate together. As you can see, the soup is ready. The soup is very, very ready. Wow. This one is mouth watering soup. Oh. As you can see, all the ingredients that's inside the dry fish the goat meat all the ingredients as you can see the soup is ready so i'm dishing out the one we will eat from the pot as you can see wow mouth watering soup you need to test this come and test come and dish yours the soup is enough for everybody come and dish mouth watching soup so guys thank you for watching my channel thank you for watching the video so make sure you subscribe share my video with your family and friends okay so next time make sure i do a wonderful video again next time i will do a nice video more than this one so thank you for watching look at the soup look at very very yummy bye bye guys thank you for watching